Hey guys, in this video I'm going to be showing you a delicious dish that is high in nutrients, low in calorie density and oil free. For years I have been trying to look for a good low fat plant based recipe for butter chicken, but since it is such a high fat dish I've never been able to find one. So through lots of trial and error, here is my remake on butter chicken, minus the butter and the chicken. Hi, my name is Taylor, welcome to my channel. The goal of this channel is to show you what has helped both myself and my mum to lose a combined weight of over 72 pounds and to help you lose weight in the most effective and sustainable way possible so you not only lose weight but keep it off for life. No oil or butter is one of the keys to following the starch solution. Cooking with no oil or butter can take some time to get used to. It is an easy way to reduce the calories of any meal and honestly in a meal like this one you won't miss it at all. The chickpeas are super healthy and high in protein. We serve over rice which is a wonderful and filling starchy food or you could serve over quinoa for something a bit different. You could serve with veggies or add veggies in which of course will reduce the calories even further. If you've been looking for a great way to get more flavours and less calories into your meals, then this recipe is a great option for you. You can play around with the spices, make it a bit spicier. This one I'd rate as quite mild. First put on a couple of cups of rice or quinoa so that it is ready for serving once the curry is done. Starting with one medium sized brown onion or I used half a large onion diced. Pop that into a large pot with one tablespoon of water, three teaspoons of minced garlic and two teaspoons of minced ginger. Cook that down on a low heat until the onion softens, then add 4 tablespoons of tomato paste, 2 tablespoons of plant based chicken stock, 1 teaspoon of ground paprika and ground cumin. Two teaspoons of ground turmeric and garam masala and a quarter of a teaspoon of chili powder. We like to use cashmere chili powder because it is not as spicy but you can use regular to make it hotter. And finally an eighth of a teaspoon of ground black pepper and two teaspoons of mustard powder. Give that a stir and then we're going to put two and a half tablespoons of cornstarch in a cup with a plant based milk. I prefer to use oat or soy milk. Stir well and then add to the pot along with another cup of milk and one cup of water.
give that a stir and let simmer while you cut three medium sized pre-cooked purple kumaras into small squares. Add to the pot along with two cups of pre-cooked or canned chickpeas. Let that cook for a few more minutes on high to heat the kumara and chickpeas through. And then remove from heat and serve over rice or quinoa. This dish serves around five hungry people. Hopefully you get a chance to enjoy this meal. We have many other lower calorie and starch solution compliant recipes on our channel. So make sure you go check them out. Subscribe to our channel and click the notification bell to be notified every week when I post a new video. If you have any questions, please just comment below. I would love to help you get on a better path with your healthy eating and weight loss goals. And I'll see you guys in the next video.